Here we are. Raven's Thwarp. Raven's Twerp. Raven's... I'm gonna stop this bit. This is a bad bit. Anyways, uh, did I have any quests to be doing? Berserker, a new home, reach settlement level 3. Viking for hire, complete 10 contracts. Find and kill the members of the order. A brief history of the hidden one. Find all codex pages. So I guess a mysterious berserker is what we're gonna do now. Because there doesn't seem to be much else. Oh. I forgot how to run for a second. I was like, is this really as fast as I can go? I mean, even Eivor's sprint is a little, uh, little slower than I'd hoped. Yeah, this is slow going. Anyways, there's only 3,000 meters, right? Is there a fast travel point around there? World. Uh, where am I going? Where is my quest? I'm not seeing it on the map. Am I just blind? Oh, it's way, 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 way over here. Holy crap. Uh, so I guess this is the closest fast travel point. And it leads to a boat. Is, is my computer telling me if things right? Because, like, I'm having the best bit rate, I, like, uh, output rate I've ever had. Sail! Catch the wind! And, like, yeah. It's saying I'm putting out almost 8,000 kilobits a second. Usually I max out around 2. Uh, not 2, like 25-ish is around my typical ceiling. But I'm getting, like, 5,000, 6,000, 6,000 pretty steady right now. That's insane. It's very quiet on this boat. Aren't they supposed to sing to me or something? That's that. Make sure to save the game. I've never created like an actual saved game, like a manual save. I've just been depending on autosave. What am I, a monster? What was I doing for like the three weeks I played this game? Hey, that's my Jesus. Oh, great. Boat. Fire. Fire. Ah, go on. Okay, I'm still getting into the swing of things. There we go. So, how do I play this game again? These are good questions. Oh, they're on the other side of the... the lake? Come on... There we go. And then go forward. There we go, just lead my boat around there. Alright, open those sails. Follow that river, go to quest objective, and now I can sit back again and just talk. <sighs> yeah, my, this is the best I've had a stream in, like, forever. Holy crap. My internet's really chugging today. Sailing is too risky now. Why? Why is it too risky? Oh, the bridge. Take the mask down. Sit the minion in! The fact that that mast hits no one in the head is very surprising. Mast up! I wonder, did they actually have, like, did longships, uh, in this time actually have masts that moved like that? Like, was that a common thing? Oh, we're still so far from it. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Hundred more meters. Wow. Where did it go? Sail down. Oh, I have to go find Bjorn. 
who travels with a white bear. I mean, that was a risky dive. Holy crap. Let's see you, old friend. Uh, somewhere in this area-ish is Bjorn. So let's go over there and see if I can see him. He's probably by the waterfall, right? He lives in a cave, so it's definitely behind the waterfall. That's just how video games work. That must be Bjorn the Sarga. I'm speaking to him, so I don't have to worry about killing him. My eyes cannot forget the sight, Bjorn. Her hair so long and falling down. How are you cold? A man who fights beside a great white bear. You or Bjorn Bloodtooth? Ask the dead. What do they tell you? They say... We do not want shapeshifters in these lands. They wished me dead. They are not the first. And you? Come to make your name in battle. Another corpse at my door won't matter. I'm not here to fight you, Bjorn. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan, and I offer you a seat in our hall. I have no clan, and no need of another. You prefer to live alone here with your bear? I prefer vengeance against the men who hung my wife and left her for the crows. Who is this man? A Mercian lord. Whose name shall not sour my lips. He has scores of men. An army, perhaps. But that will not stop me. Then let me help. If you truly wish to avenge your wife, you must not fall in battle. I shall think it over. Njal, go with my bear. Feel her belly. Oh. And if Njal trusts you, who knows? Maybe we do as you say. Oh, okay then. You're tame for so wild a beast. Is that so? Tell me, what does a bear like you eat? Whatever you want, huh? First you show me that. Oh, okay. That happened. The subtitles really got in the way of the bear, though. Um, so that's unfortunate. Right, this is how I meditate and use my cloak and all that. The skulls say Bjorn carried you into battle when you were but a bear cat. Raised you as one would raise a child. Cool, my rations are full. I'm following a bear. What are my what are my missions lately? I just uh, I just played The Witcher the other day again, and I had to track down a goat. And in this one, I'm following a bear. Where did I leave Your these games? They are not food, y'all. Reminds me of summer in Norway. We had fields like these near Hemingas Hall. <laughs> I can see why Bjorn keeps you around. I think Eivor is going crazy. Are we stalking the bird? Oh no, there are deer up there. Not going for the deer either? What are we going for, bear? Ah, the lake. There's fish you want. I can help with that. Fishing arrows. Now to catch something from Yao. Oh. Alright. Do I actually have to shoot a fish out of the water? That does not seem possible. There's no way this is possible. Oh. I hit something.
Do you want some fish, Nyal? Yeah. This is... This is ridiculous. I'm gonna throw that out there. What is this camera angle? Nothing better than fresh fish. Eat your fill, friend. Oh, crap. The demon bear! Alex must! That's not the berserker! Who cares? Kill them both! Oh. Oh. Keep our wits about. Ah. Ah. you were looking for him, Yell. Nice. Yarn may be in trouble as well. Broken armor. Uh, go back to uh, Bjorn. Hunter arrows. Anyways, now that I've looted, let's go save the berserker. Because they just went after his bear. Which, to be fair, all white bear in anywhere that. That does seem like sort of freaking nature in a way. I mean, albinoism. How rare is that? I imagine it's pretty rare, right? Oh, I'm out of arrows. Why are, is my attack speed so so slow? I slowed down for some reason. What is that teleportation? Holy teleportation, Batman. Nice. I just picked him up and carried him for 3,000 miles. Oh, there's more. I mean, the axe wasn't even in his head, but sure, why not? Ooh, and I think I dodged his arrow as he went to shoot me. That's pretty cool. <sighs> Albinoism is 1 in 18,000? Yeah, that's pretty rare. Oh, nice. More broken armor bits. Where are you going, dude? What are you doing? What is he doing? Sir, 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 please. I must speak with you. Dude, stop it. Dude, there you go. What is your programming? Sir, please, please stop. You have a strong war arm. Oh my goodness, what was that?
My brain is having an aneurysm. I shouldn't joke about that. That's actually a pretty serious thing. But like that AI, what was These he doing? Did not come for the fame of defeating a legendary berserker. No, they were followers of the Mercy Lord, my blood enemy, my wife's killer. Rip. How did your wife die? That's not a good question Fame to ask. has two faces, Eivor of the Ravens. In Norway, many a young Thane wanted the glory of killing me. They died. I grew tired of killing. Alfilder and I, we came here for a new start. A quiet life. But Fame sailed ahead of you. This Mercian Lord learned of your deeds, sought to boost his own name with your blood. You have the right of it. Only he wanted me to drink the Berserker brew first. When I refused, he demanded. Offered gold, even taunted me. Then he... He hung her. Arfhilda. Your blood feud is just. But if it is something you must do alone... No. Your words are wise. I do not want to die fighting. I want to die knowing my wife is avenged. I want to kill that man. Help me. Tell me what you need. Nightshade. It's the last bit of magic I need for my berserker brew. You shall have it. And when this is over, I trust the Raven Clan will have your axe. When you find the Nightshade, bring it to me beneath the gallows tree south of Beodorich's work. Nightshade often grows near graveyards, and Saxons build their graveyards near churches. All right. Nightshade grows in graveyards. No shortage of those in Christian England. The way you phrased that. But anyways, two more skill points. It's been a while since I've even viewed the skill tree. Light attack damage, sure. Light attack damage is always good. And more melee damage, that's also nice. There we go, all set. Uh, bop. <laughs> I like how Eivor always goes for the dive, even though he has no idea how deep it actually is or anything. He's just always like, oh, I guess I'm diving now. Uh, Up here is the graveyard. Plus there's a um, synchronization site. Oh my goodness. I'm really struggling today. I mean, I'm always struggling. That's just life, but you know, relatable. Um, yeah. All up this way. Let's go climb up to the uh, synchronization point. <sighs> the parkour, like... It's one thing, at, at first, I, like, one of the things I talked about really early on when I started playing this game was how much I liked this game compared to, like, previous games of this, like, semi-RPG format that Ubisoft is going for for their Assassin's Creed games. Um, like, I had a lot of praise initially, but now that I'm coming back to it after a time, I, I sort of have, like, the, um... What's it called? Rose... Rose Tint? Um... The newness of it, I guess, wore off. So I'm starting to see more of the actual issues with this game. Like, I, th I still think this game is much an improvement over, like, what they did with Odyssey in terms of actual, um... Recognizing their own brand. Because, uh, in Odyssey... Like, they basically did away with everything that had to do with assassins in that game. And then this game 
definitely embraces the assassin heritage a lot more. In here. Find a key. I can't just shoot the lock. Nope. I have to find a key. Damn it. Be my eyes. I mean, I guess... I don't have to go in there. It's in the graveyard. Nightshade has a distinct stench. Like this. It must be near. Uh-huh. That is enough, Nightshade. Foul-smelling herb. I should meet Bjorn. Alrighty, then. Alon Zed. Forgive not these men Holy their crap. trespasses. Send them instead to the same hell they brought upon our land. What happened here? Did you kill these men? These defilers killed themselves by despoiling this sacred ground. God told me the full tale. Then he told me to chastise them. And he has told me much about you, too. Oh, are you like a dope warrior nun? I mean you no harm. She's a dope warrior nun. She is not melee only. Holy crap. Tell me again. What did your god say about me? My god names you the crow eyed devil. And he sends out his angels to find you. And to kill you. Are you and part of you like the zealots you. that I uh, took down a couple demon. episodes ago? Not, I didn't take down the zealots, but I, I did something. What was it? It was um. Yeah, they had my name on a piece of paper that would mean they would come after me and stuff, and I uh, burned that paper. Uh, worthful offering. Oh lord, take these gifts, my blood offering, as a sign of devotion to your mighty cause. I have laid waste a dozen heathens for your greater glory, though one crept into the rafters to die, so that you may smite him down at your leisure. May his blood and body p please you, my lord. Your most devoted apostle. Saint Elfwin? Hammer of the heathens. <sighs> Well, that's interesting. Uh, this is a very weird game for me to play sometimes. Um, like, every, everyone should definitely have that opportunity where they see their, their religion from another site. Uh, but it can definitely be a... An uncomfortable experience um, and for a game like Assassin's Creed to be the one to tackle it for me because um, like while I don't want to say Assassin's Creed is silly or anything because it definitely has those moments where it's like this is the height of storytelling um, a lot of people say that game in particular is Revelations so which I just bought and I still need to play through um, because I bought it for PlayStation 3 forever ago when I first got my, uh... I need your eyes. My PlayStation 3. Uh, and then I ended up moving, and it was one of the games that got, like... God. Temporarily lost in the move. Um... But I recently got it for my PC, and so now I gotta play through it. Here we go. Your nightshade. Good. It has the power we need for the coming ritual. Nearly done. The Skalds say Odin hung himself in a tree much like this. He lived, though. Most die. Yggdrasil. 
the world tree, Odin's gallows, the place where life and death are one. Huh. Oh, what is this? Ride with me, Raven. The safer awaits. Oh, I really don't feel like getting drugged right now. I'm just gonna throw that out there. I'm not into this, my sir. Berserker brew hits hard. It may open your eyes to the spirit realm. It may turn you into a savage beast. Whatever right. happens, face it without fear. I'm afraid. So... What was the animation work on Eivor back there? <laughs> he was floating for a second. of blood. What are you chanting? That's... Oh. We are the shield biters, war breakers, born in battle's flood. This what edible ain't anything, you fight dude. for, you bear skins? You wolf shirts, you drinkers of blood. We I don't... fight for glory, we shield biters. What is going on? War breakers. Born in battle's flood! Uh, Alright. Oh, no. Why? What is this? What is happening? Am I seeing Bjorn, Bjorn as, like, a big old bear? Don't do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. You'll end up beating up your new best friend. As you think they become a giant bear. I've been close to death many times. But this... This was different. Ah, uh, feels like a Jotun kicked my head in. Tis glorious, is it not? Berserker brew does not... Does not agree with my belly. Don't do drugs, kids. But you live still. Can you feel the power of the bear's blood coursing through your veins? Yes. But you, you were a bear. And the bear power courses through me still. I'm ready. Where to? The Mercians who slew my wife cowered in Beodorchsworth. We shall kill them all. You really should not make any decisions well high. I'm just gonna throw that out. Show me what you can do, Berserker! I'm gonna throw that out there. Voice acting, am I right? Just, uh, two guys, high as hell, and a bear. Yeah, sure, why not? Two guys, high on devil weed. 
Charge in a church with a bear. All right, I forgot lock on was a feature. <laughs> That's right. Where the hell am I? Also, how did why did my voice get so high? Right. Y you know, this this couldn't have been better planned or anything. Why not? Yeah, sure. Good edge on you. Work with me. Right into a wall. Watch my lead. Yeah. Ooh, a skill skill points. Spread out. We have this. I missed the stomp. Oh, gross. I'm really just throwing them into walls, aren't I? Where am I supposed to be going now? Where are things happening? Where's the hippity happening? What are my words? Oh, right, yeah. Are you- are you good, sir? You sure you don't want some, like, water or coffee to sober you up? Are we sure we want him on our team? Like, sure, he's a good killer and all that, but, um... He's kind of off his rocker. Don't you think? I always wanted to fight as a worker. And a white bear rug will make a fine trophy. You will fight me. Sure, why not? Archers. 
Give me a second to loot. Together, lads, we have this. Strike for Christ. There we go. Oh, you it hit me. You bastard child. There's this guy now. Great. Get round the side. Oh, what was that? I'm running out of stamina. Cut you down. I forget. This is not uh Origins. I can't I can't charge my heavy attacks anymore. I just tap. I'm out of rations, I have no stamina, no adrenaline, nothing. Okay, I'm gonna take care of this arrow dude. Dodge and weave. Yeah, just stay back there. One arrow. One shot. Cool, cool, cool. Damn, you were annoying. Yeah, give me a second. I'm taking the three arrows that I put in him. Ooh. It's good plunder here. Yeah? But I'll need help. Oh, I'd have to raid this place with a crew. Gross. Vengeance of the Berserker. All set. All done. Plus, I have two skill points for when this finishes. Bjorn, your enemy has fallen. You have your revenge. Yes. Yee yee yee. But now I fear I must ask you one last thing. Should you be willing? What is it? Njal is tired. I will tend to her beneath the tree where this all began. Please, bring us some of her favorite flowers. They look like... I know the ones. I'll gather them and meet you beneath the gallows tree. Oh, is the bear gonna die? Bjorn is here. I saw some of Njal's favorite flowers growing beneath the gallows tree. Yeah, are... are they gonna kill the bear? Like, that just seems like a cheap way to pull the heartstrings. Because, like, no one wants to see an animal die. 
but also at the same time, I haven't really built that much of a bond with said animal. So it just feels like a cheap way to pull out the heartstrings instead of actually setting up something emotional. Oh, so by the by the gallows tree. My game just paused for a second. Cool. Some extra health. Gather flowers. Here we go. This wife's grave. Oh. One day visits this tree often. Flowers from Yarl. Now to meet Bjorn beneath the gallows tree. Beneath the gallows tree? I mean, I'm already here. Looting. Some silver. Silver is always nice. I mean, I'm supposed to meet him here, right? He's not here. So do I just meditate to wait for him or something? I mean, I guess. Let me assign some skill points and then do a quick meditation. Ability damage. Uh, light bow damage. Battleground bolt. Oh, that looks awesome. I don't use light bows, but I'll get that just so that I can increase the tree to there. That looks dope. Pick up the nearest discarded weapon and automatically throw it at an enemy in sight. That's awesome. Uh, meditation. He's supposed to be here, right? Oh, yeah, they killed the bear. Rip. I brought her here, where it began, where it ends. I understand. They hung my wife in this tree and buried her among its roots. A grim and undeserved fate. We took Njarl in as a cub. She and I. No children of our own. Now both are gone. Yet I remain. Dear Njal, you were always at my side for the better years of my life. I must have done like this. Game developers. Uh. You can only do. What we can, they live on in the Hall of, Val the Hall of Valor. Our fates were cast long ago. Njal sleeps at the Old Father's feet tonight. Yes. They let loyal hounds into the Hall of the Brave. So Njal too is there. With Alfilda. Mm. I don't know, fully understand why they had to kill the bear there. It doesn't really do much for the story. It provides a cheap emotional moment, but that's what it is. It's cheap. You know, they didn't... It, it's not deserved. It's not earned. Like, had they done more to build up, like... The relationship he has with the bear like we just met him and he's a crazy guy with a bear you you go get some fish with the bear sure Before, but that's you asked it if i would join your clan i am ready good that will be a place for you on my longship and in my clan i shall sing of alfilda and yarn during our travels sing of their deeds and I will carry their names into battle. When you're ready, follow the River Nen to my settlement. We shall welcome you as a brother. 
I will be the berserker of the Raven Clan. I think I've mentioned this basically every time I've ever played this game, but Eivor's eyes are so bright. Like, they blasted the saturation on those things. Like, I, I, I realize people can have eyes that bright. I've, I've met people with eyes that are, like, very colorful. Um, but, I don't, I don't know. It just seems like they, they, they blasted the saturation on those, because even here, where his face is cast in shadow and stuff, I see the blue almost clear as day. Uh, but anyways, I guess we go back to our settlement now. I'll have to do some raids and stuff to help uh, boost it again. Because I think that's all we have to do, get our settlement up to level 3. Jeez.